This video is brought to you by Squarespace. My name is Steven and in mere moments I'm going to surprise my very pregnant wife as in we are due in exactly seven days from today with a baby shower. One she has no idea that I've planned but before she walks through that door let's cut back to a month ago when I started planning all of this. This is my beautiful wife Jess and late last year we got the best surprise of our lives. It's like my <gasps> She is honestly my biggest inspiration, and all while having our little girl tucked away inside her tummy, she trekked through 18 countries in the warmest of days and the coldest of nights. Nothing would stop her until a global pandemic kind of forced us to stop, nest a little home while we wait for our little girl to arrive. For all the adventures and amazing experiences we've been on, it does come at a small price. Being away all year round means not being able to see our friends and family on the weekends and missing birthdays, Christmases and barbecues. And one little bit of excitement is that we were wanting to throw a baby shower where all our friends and family could come together in our house and celebrate our new baby. But due to COVID-19 and our recommendations from our Premier of social distancing, our baby shower had to get cancelled. And I just wanted to quickly say, as small and irrelevant as one person's baby shower being cancelled, while there are thousands of people out there losing their lives and jobs, as a husband, it did still hit me really hard watching my wife tear up as she cancelled her dream baby shower. Jess has no idea that I'm currently filming this video. It is currently April 14th and next month I want to throw Jess her dream baby shower for just me and her in quarantine. But the only thing is I have no idea how to throw a baby shower. I think I'm gonna need to get in touch with some of Jess's closest friends and family to give me some ideas because I have no idea. I think the audio is connecting. Cool, it's just connecting. Oh, hello? Hey, Beck! Hello, Mima, how you doing? I'm doing fine. You can hear me. How's it hello. going? Hello. Hey, Hugo. How you going? I'm good. How are you going? I see you've uh, dyed the hair to match the jumper. I did. Is it, is it a bit red? Okay, good. This is Larry. Oh, hey, Larry. I have a favor. Your sister, did you notice she's having a baby soon? Wait, Jess? Yes. A baby? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Surprise! So, as you know at the moment there seems to be a bit of a, in a bit of a pandemic. I'm aware. I oh. noticed. You noticed. I did notice that. Oh, yes. <laughs> that kind of means that we can't have a baby shower. Sadly, we can't hang out anymore. I can't organise it. Which I, sucks. I was thinking of throwing her a surprise baby shower for just me and her. I got my little, got my little planning hat. <laughs> Yay! Oh! Official baby shower. Not planning for Jess. Wow. This is the best thing ever. No, my favorite part is that you got it in pink. That's definitely the highlight. You're a bloody genius. <laughs> so baby showers are generally. A female affair, would you agree? I think guys aren't even allowed to come. No, not usually. I would agree, that is the general trend, for sure. I have no idea. I want to throw her baby shower. What is involved? Okay, I have lots of ideas. Are you going to have a theme? Like pirates? Yeah. No, pirates. She's very girl. But like a Mad Hatter theme or like a Disney theme, because I know Jess loves Disney. What I think you and Jess, but you are particularly good at is helium balloons. I'm thinking food. The whole table is full of food. Bliss balls, you know, like something yes. yummy, but also yeah, healthy. Yeah, yeah. Have like donuts hanging. Well, considering that it's a quarantine baby shower, in non-quarantine ones, you'd have games. The funnest part is the games. A lot of uh, baby showers have games, so like pass the parcel or like. Or like pass the diaper. Is you get nappies okay. and you melt different chocolate bars into the nappies. <laughs> I think I see where you're going with this. And then Jess has to figure out, she figure it out. find out which one is actually 
not chocolate. <laughs> Where are you going to use yourself as the specimen for that? It's disgusting. This is why, this is why boys aren't allowed to be involved in these things. There's always a section where it says like advice for the new mummy and people will fill it out. So if there's people that can come, if you could face on this like website, you can FaceTime them and then you can play games with them, even heads up, seven up. Honestly, I would be more than happy to do it though, Steve. I have a friend who makes really amazing cakes that lives in Perth. I'm gonna message her and see if she will make one. I'll pay for it. No, 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 you don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll pay yeah. for it. No, 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 no. But here's the thing, you've done everything. <laughs> I appreciate the help. It sucks that it's quarantine, but I love that you're going to so much effort to make it so special still. Oh, like, thanks, thanks. even though everyone can't be there and that sucks, like, it's still going to be so memorable because yeah. it's a crazy time and you're doing good, kid. I'm proud of you. <laughs> oh, thank you. Where is Jess? Well, she isn't part of this call because it's a secret. We keep it a secret from her. Well, well, well. This is happening again. Even after the uh, chaos of last week. <laughs> so one thing before Jess had to initially cancel the baby shower that she wanted to host, she managed to order one thing on Etsy. It was, it was actually very simple. It was some cookie cutters. So it's like shaped as a bottle, shaped as like an outfit shaped as like a, a little rattle um, and they've kind of just been sitting kind of sadly in the bottom of our drawer so I thought I'd honor this for Jess bake the cookies so at least when she comes to the baby shower it's like a, a little piece of her helping plan the baby shower so I'm gonna make some cookies some sugar cookies with some icing but the chaos of uh, today planning begins now um, when you buy just terrible icing sugar and <laughs> How well this is gonna turn out. Okay, so to distract Jess, get her out the house, Heidi was kind enough to say, hey, do you wanna just go head out shopping? So Jess was like, that sounds great. So this is what happens when you have two people that don't know how to direct. So we're just standing here in Mount Lawley, um, trying to be one with the map, <laughs> and it's not working out very well. When Heidi came in, cause she's helping actually prepare some amazing things. Look at what she's done. She's made some like high tea for us. Look at these incredible balls. Another thing just got delivered. Everyone's been so generous with helping us. So Beck and Paul and all the kids have organized a baby cake for us. Look at this thing. Like, oh my goodness, it's amazing. But now that Jess has left the house, it is time to fully decorate. Wish me luck guys. <laughs> you are particularly good at is helium balloons. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is gonna give me an anxiety attack. <laughs> Alrighty, got a little donut wall. I think we can hold 20 donuts. When you move is electrified, you know how to get it's a girl, so should I have like blue balloons? Pink balloons. Pink balloons. Oh, okay, cool. I'll make sure I... And I like the way you move. I like the way you move. Everything you do. So <laughs> 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 it's so bloody. That's right. Cupcakes. Some friends that I call that for advice have asked me to come and pick up some gifts to add to the baby shower. So I'm running around collecting some presents to put up. So my sister-in-law, she runs like a little business on the side from home. She does like succulents, so she did really cute little pink succulents. That's um, so cool. Different prizes, which and I just realised it's probably just going to be Jess winning all the succulents to go in the house. Okay, we're trying to look for our own whistle. This is what Jess took us. Um, definitely was not expecting post. There's baby stuff on it. We have surprise presents from Amazon. Oh, what is this? I have no idea whoever sent this. Thank you so much. We just wanted to say a huge thank you to our friends over at Squarespace for partnering up with us on this video. If you are new around here, Squarespace is the amazing all-in-one platform that helps you create your dream website or blog. We have used them in the past to create beautiful posts of our past travels, and you can use them to keep your family updated with their award-winning designer templates. And 
thanks to their 24 seven customer support, you can get online quicker and easier. So if you've created a website with Squarespace, make sure you use the built-in simultaneous social media posting to share with us your website so we can check them out. So when you're ready to launch, make sure you head to squarespace.com for your free trial and check out our URL in the link below to get 10% off your first website or domain. Now let's get back to the video. Everyone that has given presents over the week, you guys are seriously amazing. Thank you so much. I think Jess is going to be shocked. I'm shocked. Wow. What is this? Whoever this is, you think you're going to make me cry because this is just too much. Thank you so much. But what I decided to do was so that her family and her friends can feel a bit more involved. I went and got some like baby prediction cards, what they think she, when she'll be born, labor length, some like advice from like cousins and aunties and friends and stuff. So then I'll put these and then eventually we'll stick them into the baby book, but at least Jess can kind of feel like they're here in spirit because we got all these for her. Alrighty, kind of one of the finishing touches. You can't have a baby shower without a welcoming sign. Now, I did get this made and printed over a month ago. I was initially planning to have this baby shower on Jess's birthday. Birthday week happened, so I had to push it back a couple of days. So the date's a little bit wrong, but also I can't reprint it today. So hopefully, yeah, it's all good. Jess just arrived, she's gone down. I see her coming through into the house. All right, time for the show time. I have a little invitation for her, inviting her to a private baby shower with me and her. Let's see how she reacts. I have one last surprise for you. <laughs> you need to put this on. Okay. I know that birthday week is over, but I thought... Put this on. Okay. Hold my hand. <laughs> Should I put my stuff down? Yeah. I'll take you somewhere. <laughs> Can I put this down? Yeah. Yeah. Go through there, and that's just the bedroom. Yeah, I know. Okay. Take a seat. Two seconds. Alrighty. You can take off your eye mask. <laughs> what does it say? <laughs> I'm cry. Oh, just don't cry. You're gonna make me cry. <laughs> I just thought you were so excited. It's so to cute. <laughs> she was... uh, it says. <laughs> oh no! Don't. It's too early in the day. Yeah. It says, "Hey, Bubby, you're invited to join us too in celebrating Jess, the new mum to be. Time when you're ready. Saturday, May 16th." Yeah, I wanted to do it on your birthday, but I had to postpone it a couple of days, oh. and I already had this printed. And then you have to RSVP. Oh my god, this is so cute. <laughs> Join us too. Me and you. You. It's just me and you. Oh, okay. and the baby. <laughs> Aww. So are you wanting to come to the baby shower? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now what do I do? Well, let's go have a baby shower. <laughs> oh, I'll take my shoes off. <laughs> okay, get comfy. So. Oh my god! <laughs> Jess, you're gonna make me cry, don't! Thank you so much! Oh. oh, it's everything that I wanted in the baby shower! Well, should I take you on a bit of a walk around? <laughs> donuts and the cake! <laughs> oh my gosh, dude, this is so mad! Oh, you're making me cry, don't! <laughs> oh my gosh! So, over here, I thought we would do yes, some. Yes, this is what I wanted to do! <laughs> <laughs> We got some games set up, so this is 29 baby photos, and you have to try and I guess. I can tell some. <laughs> and if you look, <laughs> that's Paul. <laughs> oh my gosh! If you look behind you, I have some prizes made up. <laughs> Little what? Jess's baby shower succulents. Oh, so these are like the prizes if we win this, the games. This is the prizes if we oh win the games. Oh my gosh, the cake is. So I know. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> we had... This is crazy! We had to do a grazing board. Oh my gosh, Steve! And um, if you come over here, there is a little present station set up. Some people have been very generous. Got the balloons! <laughs> oh, that's cute! Oh yes, it's my favorite color doll! Oh, oh my gosh! 
I'll give you a hug. There's so much food and I just went out to eat. Oh, I'm so full. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad you like it. <laughs> Okay. It's cool because it's a lot of the things that I was going to do. Oh, I'm so happy. Wow. What do you want to do? Wait, so tell me, what do we do? <laughs> well, I was thinking because there is a big... <laughs> okay. I, um, what happened? I try to do some baking now. Yeah, these are the templates that I bought. Y yes, I thought I'd do this because this is kind of like you helping plan <laughs> the bake. Oh, I want to show you something else, actually. Yeah. Before we continue. Wait, this time <laughs> the cake! <gasps> and it's just baby caramel and that on it. There's another thing here to help you feel more connected. I went and got baby predictions and also like advice from all your family so it feels like they're here. And I also got a little <laughs> baby shower book. I can't show the baby shower book, but yeah. I also love how it all says the 16th of May on it. <laughs> I know, I know. It's so cute, Steve. So. Oh my gosh. How would you like? Let's do a present. Wait, I feel like I need to get a tissue. Okay, go get a <laughs> tissue. I'll bring you one. You can take you take a seat oh over my there. Gosh, you're so lucky the baby hasn't come yet. <laughs> I'm so glad you're happy. I wanna let you open up a present. Alright, just put that on. Oh my gosh, what have you done? Don't make me cry again, okay? Okay, just hold my hand. Today we are releasing a roadmap. Phase two will be introduced from Monday, May 18. Indoor and outdoor non-work gatherings will be lifted to a maximum of 20 people. I'm scared. You don't have to be scared. I'm just gonna open a door. Cleo, did you see the exciting news? I think I have a new plan for the baby shower. I'm gonna push it back two days and it involves you and everybody. Hold the hand. Just come out here. Just around here. Alrighty. Said I'm Open your eyes. <laughs> Can't have a baby shower without any guests. <laughs> and we set oh up a gosh. picnic table for you. Whoa. You guys want to come see the so baby shower? Are you going to come see the house? <laughs> you want to see the house or anything? Oh, Opening gosh. presents! <laughs> <laughs> it's so cute. Oh, yeah. I can tell her all my friends. Springs in bloom. Oh, why are you doing this? <laughs> wow. Welcome to the baby shower, Grandma. Colors like I haven't seen. <laughs> because I'm with you. Yeah, I know. Did I win my prize? Did Jess? Guys? You won? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's not fair. Look at my baby. Look at my baby. What? <laughs> I think Sam's beating you now. Oh, yeah. oh Sam! <laughs> I'm bring out this amazing cake. Yeah. What's your step? I'm gonna sing a happy birthday. <laughs> yeah, I suppose it was a couple of days ago. Ready? Happy birthday <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Jess. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> 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 Happy birthday to you. 